it in my swillies. Welcome back for another episode of Doomsday Last Survivors. All right, so for this episode, I'm just going to give you guys a quick update on what I'm working on, how I'm doing it, and why it's working and why it may not be working. But it's going to take some of you guys that are, you know, veteran players to tell me why it's not working. Now, I'm trying to build some power. You guys, I see that I have 8,688,856. Now, what I've been doing was upgrading my troops. Rather than making some fresh ones, I would go here to one of my little barracks here. And I would just, you know, go to here and I would uh, upgrade my troops. All right. So that's going to give you a little bit of power. It's not going to give you very much, but it'll give you some. All right. So what I'm trying to see is should I just keep on making fresh troops, you know, spending the resources, which I don't mind, or should I just... Uh, make some fresh ones let's start making some fresh ones because right now this is going to give me some fresh tier fours here 1500 and if i if i retrain it's going to be another 1500 which is good i'm, gonna, I'm still going to get the same amount of t4s but i'm just going to have a little bit less power i think i'll get more power if i make some fresh ones so let me know in the comments below guys a lot of you veteran players do know that all right so i'm trying to get to at least 10 million power i should be there already at some point um let's see let's turn that off first of all Go ahead and train some more guys. It's gonna be an hour a day, and then also, I am going. I got headquarters 22 cooking up right now. It's got 10 more days, but it's a total of 14 days. But we got 10 days right now, which is okay. All right, so I'm okay with that. Finally, starting to get some kind of growth. Finally, all right. So that's just a couple of different things that I'm kind of wondering about. Now, for the most part, I've been trying to get a lot of these buildings. I've been getting them around you know level 21, especially like the. Uh, the resource ones all right so once the resource ones get up to about 21 ish which they're all like 19 well the oil ones are 19 these ones are okay i'm okay with these i don't care about those too much i know when i get like i think once we get the headquarters 22 we're gonna start getting demands for oil and stuff like that i know we're gonna get demands because right now um wood is like the main thing for me right now and also the uh, what is that the steel steel is the main one right there as well um, but all my other resources are 21. They're all maxed out. All of them. Steel, wood, and food. It's just these three last ones that are not 21 up for the oil. Okay? So I'm getting everything else like that leveled up like it needs to be. And then also, it's also telling me some things that says, hey, go ahead and do heavy industry as far as your research goes. Oh, man. I got my research out in the open and everything. Oh, snap. All right. So one thing that I would probably recommend... Now, if you ever use some of these little resources here, let me just go ahead and back up a little bit here, like as far as your buffs go. If you're using these resources to do your eight hour food boost or eight hour wood, eight hour steel, or also the eight hour for the oil, you, the best thing that you probably possibly can do in my eyes, what's working for me as far as researchers go, um, this category right here. All right, so superior fertilizer, mechanical felling, converter steel making crude oil refining you want to try to max these things out as much as you can possibly and then you should be good to go and because that's going to help that's going to uh, let me go ahead and click on it so you guys can see that's going to give you the food production wood production of course um steel production and oil production respectively okay so if you use those those eight hour boosts right there as long as you have these right here maxed or close to max you should be good to go you'll get those um you'll see more results from those from doing so uh, for what I've seen, because I have not been farming for resources that much at all. You know, where I'm at, the nodes are like fours and you're lucky if you can get a couple fives and six are there and people aren't really clearing their nodes, stuff like that. All right. So you just got to go through and just do these right here. These are the ones I can recommend for you guys. Just knock those out right there. Do your hives whenever you can. If you can't do your hives, it is what it is. And also, make sure you do this little exploration thing. These things are great, but sometimes they get kind of annoying. <laughs> the dog with the butter. Dog. Dog with butter, the butter. Dog. butter. I am not going to lie. These things are somewhat annoying right here, but they give good resources. And you can get some free troops out of the whole deal, too. You just click on it. You're going to get some troops. You got I got four different possibilities right there. And, of course, they're going to probably spawn. And then I can do some more things right here. But you don't want to not do this right here. All right, so at some point, right now I'm only getting tier threes off of these guys. Um, at some point, I think when I level up, because right now I'm level 22 on this, um, I will start getting the tier fours. I think probably, I don't know if it's 30. I don't know what level you get those. So if somebody does know, 
please in the comments below guys let me know i really want to know because this is something i think that is going to be good this helps you get self-sufficient here you don't have to worry about you know doing too much it's got to be uh pretty consistent and you can do this two times a day basically every 12 hours you're going to knock this out you know if you miss it you missed it oh well you know it's not a big deal not a big deal tough titty said the kitty but I would recommend you guys knocking these things out. But I'm just trying to give you guys a little update on what I'm doing here. Um, <clears throat> I didn't do my food boost yet because I'm probably going to be not going to be online for a while. So I'm not going to waste an eight hour boost um, doing that. Usually it works out when I know I'm going to be on. All right. And also your campaigns. I'm still on the first Z virus. I'm not anywhere near on this right here. I've been slacking. I'm on level 80 on the story mode, which I know it goes more. Of course, if we beat that, I think we did beat that. We beat 80. Yeah, we got the first victory award. We got that, I thought. For some reason, it doesn't go on any further. I guess maybe it's not unlocked. I don't know. And then the challenge mode, I am on 60 on a challenge mode all the way. I think we got the same. What is 80? Oh, no, this goes way over here, man. Damn. All the way to 100, man. So 100, we're at 60 out of 100 on the challenge mode. So we'll start knocking those things out. If you're trying to get those little resources to upgrade and level up your heroes, well, there you go. All right, so that's what I'm working on here, guys please feel free to chime in. I am okay with constructive criticism, what I should be doing, what I shouldn't be doing. Am I doing something wrong? I don't know. I'm still trying to figure the game out myself. It's not really too much guidance out there, but I'm trying to give you guys as much guidance as I can find it. Uh, but either way, guys, thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys found some sort of uh, something in this video that helped you guys out. And if you guys did, consider subscribing and also drop a like on the video, guys. And it does help out. Trust me, it really helps out the channel helps push it out to other players. I know there's some players out there that can't even play the game right now because it's not released in their country. I don't have the answers for that kind of stuff. I've, I've been asking around. I reach out to the developers. They don't really answer me back, those kind of things. So I don't, I don't know what to tell you guys as far as like those people that are probably, I think Brazil, they don't have it in their country and a few other ones. I, I don't know. I can't really remember off the top of my head because they, they, they reach out to me in comments and ask me, hey, when's this game getting released in, you know, X country or whatever, you know, those kind of things. I don't really know. I, I'll ask for you guys. You know, but if I don't get the answer back, then I don't know what to tell you. I've done lots of research trying to figure that out. And there is nothing, man. This game is like, it's almost like this game doesn't exist. <laughs> but it does exist in our eyes because we're playing it. I'm enjoying it. This is probably my number one game that I do play on a day-to-day -day basis. And I would highly recommend you guys play it as well. Hashtag not sponsored. Developers. Hmm. Okay. But it's all good. Um, I don't complain or anything like that, but it's all good, baby, baby. But either way, guys, I'd like to see you guys on the next one. Peace out.